Welcome everyone. So yes, a lot of people thought that 3 raised to 3 divided by 3 raised to 3 divided by 3 raised to 3 divided by 3 raised to 3 is nothing but just 1 and cube root of 1 will always get you 1 but that is incorrect. Now please understand whenever you have a division sign between two numbers, okay, here you will always follow the principle of KCF means here let's say 3 raised to 3 will not consider the cube root right now. First, K stands for keeping the first number as it is. C stands for changing the division sign to multiplication. And F stands for flipping or taking the reciprocal of 3 raised to 3. So that is getting you 1 upon 3 raised to 3. <coughs> Similarly, again, here also we will first change the sign. Then we will take the reciprocal. So 1 upon 3 raised to 3. Here also we will change the sign and take the reciprocal. So this and this gets cancelled and we are just left with 3 raised to 1 upon 3 raised to 3 into 1 upon 3 raised to 3. Now please understand 1 into 1 is just 1. Now a raised to m into a raised to n. When the bases are same, the indices are different. Okay, in that case, you can directly add the index. Okay, so here also we will do 3 raised to 3 plus 3 that is getting you 6. So now eventually we can say instead of this 1 which a lot of people thought this is coming out to be cube root of 1 upon 3 raised to 6. So now see understand cube root or nth root of any number can be written as a raised to 1 upon n. Okay so here we can this we can write this as nothing but what 1 upon 3 raised to 6 the whole raised to 1 upon 3 correct. Now, 1, so we see, please understand, a upon b, the whole raised to n can be written as a raised to n upon b raised to n. So, this can be written as 1 upon 1 raised to 3, 1 raised to 1 upon 3 and we have 3 raised to 6, the whole raised to 1 upon 3. Now, as we all know that 1 raised to any number will always be 1 and a raised to m the whole raised to n gets you what a raised to m into n so this will become 3 raised to 6 into 1 upon 3 now you will see things are cancelling 1s are and 2s are so basically answer comes out to be 1 upon 3 square or you can also write this as 1 upon 9 so now i can say that the answer for this one is just 1 upon 3 square or 1 upon Nine. I hope this is very very clear to everyone. That's it for today. I will see you in the next video.